was weighing day as well and I lost a pound and a half, was it? Um, not taking measurements yet, I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Yeah, I've got the belt, I've got the pre workout. Let's do this. So we are heading to the gym right now. I just thought while we were driving down there, I might as well talk to you about how this week's gone. I feel tighter overall. I did feel really bloated before. Um, you saw from the kind of progress shot. Um, so I do, I feel a lot tighter. This week I've upped my cardio. I've added in another 50 calories on both of my sessions. Training, I've kept exactly the same. Um, and same for my macros, I've kept my macros the same because I've dropped a pound and a half, so there's no need for me to drop them just yet. I've not plateaued out, um, so that's that. That's another tip for you guys, like don't always feel like every week you need to adjust your macros or drop your macros. You don't want to drop them too soon because then your body will adjust to that and then you'll need to just drop them even lower. So make use of it when your body is dropping on higher macros. So I'm going to stick to those, see how we get on this week. Um, training exactly the same, so on legs now and then rotating throughout the week. So I'll let you know how this week goes, but overall I'm pleased. First week into the cut, we'll get there, we'll get there. And what you didn't tell me so well is that I have powder on my toes. That's pre-workout, saving it for later. cakes before with my iced coffee. The iced coffee's got minimal calories so I don't actually scan that in. And then <laughs> intra workout I ended up getting a Lucas Aid Sport just for some intra workout carbs because I was dying during those deadlifts. So totals wise I'm on, I've had 50 grams of carbs, quite a bit of sugar so low for sugar from now, 2 grams of fat and 2 grams of protein. So now a high protein meal is needed. <laughs> Come on, let's 
So, post-workout meal, I have got one chicken breast, 150 grams of chicken. I've also got a full courgette and um, 80 grams of avocado. So I'm sparing my carbs and I seasoned my chicken with the Gym Chef tomato and herb seasoning. So this is really macro friendly as well. I'm also having one of these light and free Greek style strawberry yogurts. Um, they, the macros aren't on here so I'll put them on the screen. But they are zero fat and as you can see, 58 calories per pot. The carbs are quite average but tastes really good. It's better than just plain yogurt. So I'm gonna have one of those.